Hi guys, it's me again from The Real Me Naturally and today I am going to be talking about the, what I've been doing since my mom's passing. Uh, it's been 10 months now that she's been gone and um, I just want to sh talk to you all about some things about how I'm doing. But first I want to get to some things that I have new. I'm so excited. Y'all, you guys know that I love things and uh, brushes, of, um, like makeup brushes and stuff like that. And so I got this brush right here for makeup and it's a contour brush. And I'm really wanting to try this out. I have not tried this brush out yet, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be good and everything so yeah but that's what i wanted to show y'all and then i wanted to show y'all my new case yes that i am absolutely loving love 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 this case now the case now this came from five and below yes okay i, I my first time ever being in five and below and my daughter wanted to go so bad y'all but uh yeah this is where i got this case and i'm so so loving it is so so soft y'all Oh my gosh, my daughter, my oldest daughter picked this up and she was like, oh my gosh, I love your case. And she said, I just want to go to sleep with this case. I could just fall asleep with it, with, it, with it in my hands. And I'm like, really? I know it's that soft. But yeah, so, and then I wanted to show y'all this black, uh, yes, this black mask that I got. It's a peel off mask. Never have tried the black mask, but I heard that it pulls out all the dirt. And as I read it on the uh, bottle or the product thing, it, it on the packaging anyway, it pulls out all the dirt out of your pores. So I just want to give that a try. But I'm going to be eating my peanuts like I always do, you all. And as you can see, they're almost gone because I just love to eat my peanuts. I wasn't a real fan of peanuts a while ago. Uh, well... For years, I mean, I, you know, I barely eat peanuts, you know. But I like like the cashews and the the almonds. But you know, I always try to get the mixed nuts so I can get a variety. But anyway, yeah. Then I have my Snapple right here that I'm drinking. I love, love, love this stuff. And I put it in the freezer and forgot that it was in the freezer, y'all. What was I thinking? I woke up, I opened the freezer, and I was like. And it was kind of dripping out, and I'm like, oh my goodness. Mm. But yeah, this is, I just wanted to come and talk to y'all about how I am doing since my mom's been gone. And I'm going to tell you, it is not easy, y'all. It's not easy. I think about my mom day and night. Um, and sometimes if a memory comes and I'll think about her like, you know what I'm saying? Um, and before, when she first passed, it was so hard. It was like, it was, it was so hard. It was like, I just couldn't get her off my mind. Like, am I going to lose it because I can't get, get her off my mind? Um, so, um, it was not easy from the beginning. And, um, it's still not easy because, you know, even though I, you know, people look happy, you know, still, even though they're going through, you know, they're grieving. And um, you, we still go through that grieving process. It's like a up and down like thing. Like sometimes you're up and then sometimes you're down. And I never understood during the holidays how people would be so down. But I understand. I understand now because my mom, like I said, she loved Thanksgiving. She loved Christmas. And she loved to cook. She loved to um, she loved to decorate for Christmas. I mean, as soon as December hit, she's decorating the whole house. She's so full of joy, so happy. Um, but I go back and I think about you know how she lost her her mom and how my mom. I didn't really see. A lot of emotion out of her you know what I'm saying I'm pretty sure she went away and cried or or whatever you know I try to not cry in front of my children you know um, but I really owe it to God for helping me to get through this because it has not been easy and um, I really 
I really know that it's God because I asked him a long time ago when my mom was sick to help me with this. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm looking out this way, y'all. I'm, I'm looking out the window and it's just hard. I love to look at the trees and everything, y'all. And, and it's just probably sprinkling a little bit, but not that much. But yeah, I'm just, um, that's where I'm at. I mean, I'm, I'm still doing okay. I'm doing okay, you know, but I have those times where the grieving will come and I'm still kind of like, you know, hurting, you know what I'm saying, because I miss her so much and I'm so used to talking to her that it's like, wow, you know, that, that level of mom-daughter thing is just not there. And then, and then another thing, my siblings aren't as close as we used to be, which we wasn't really that close when she was alive anyway because everybody was just so spread out you know so far away and so this and that but uh like i said it's just it's kind of hard dealing with this but being on youtube making my funny videos and uh exercising doing all of those things has truly helped me to just get through just to have something to do and um, I dealt with some things. Um, I was working when my mom, when she first came here, I was working. And now I'm not working. Um, but I am doing, like, working on my own businesses. Of course, I still have that. But, I mean, you know what I'm saying? I'm not going to a job. You know what I'm saying? So, that's, that's that. And I had been looking for a job for a while. But my job did not treat me right. And I said I won't go back to that job. And I probably won't go back to another job but I might because because I'm in the process of won't sorry someone's at my door. So like I said, it was a strong hard road, but easily I'm getting fine getting through it because of God. Only because of his help. He is so so awesome. He's an awesome God, a magnificent God, a loving God, a God that will be there for you when you think that you can't make it. And you can't make it because he's there. He's right there holding your hand through thick and thin. When you feel like you don't have a friend, he's right there holding your hand. And I just love him. I love him. If you don't know Jesus, please get to know him. He will take you through things that you can't even imagine you can go through. So I just wanted to leave y'all with that today. And praying that you all would just give your life to God and know that he is there. And that he loves you and he will take care of you. He will strengthen you and give you peace in the midst of the storm and the time of troubles. Um, you know, so that's how I've been doing. Um, just trusting God every day, reading my Bible, praying, and just knowing that he's got my back no matter what's going on, you know. And then I just heard that my friend lost her mom um, sometime in August. And I just was like, what? Like... I just found that out, and I'm like, it's a lot of people have left here this year. I'm like, you know, so just trust God, you know, because um, we don't know what's going to happen. We don't know when we leave in here, and it's best to have your life already ready, and just like you're leaving the next minute or the next day or today. I mean, just, you have to be ready for that. You have to be ready and know that. God is going to take you up with him when, when it's time to go. So, I thank you for your time. And I'm going to come with many more videos. And if you are a newbie, thank you for joining me and subscribing to my channel. And if you're new and you haven't already subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. So you can receive more videos, more story times, more cleanup, more, you know, because I do cleanup on my channel too. And I do beauty and like I said, I have another channel um, called Unique Laughs. And if you want to go over there, if you're feeling down, just go over there. And uh, it will lift your spirits because it is so funny. It makes me laugh. But until next time on The Real Me, join me again on The Real Me Naturally. And I greatly appreciate it. And you all have a blessed day. Bye-bye.